Hey guys, it's Swift Excalibur, and today we are going to be looking at some um, favela. And uh, this is from Modern Warfare 2, for those of you who recognize it. I apologize if you heard my phone go off in the background. Um, but this is uh, this is the map that was removed for um, uh, for what I what I understand was slander against um, the I think Islamic community because this painting here um, if you zoomed in with a sniper onto the rim uh, it was still quite difficult to see but you could see Arabic writing now if you spoke Arabic you um, you could or could read Arabic rather uh, what it said was something along the lines of praise Allah, or, you know, it was something, I don't think it was offensive um, to the god himself, or whoever that goes, I, I don't really know anything about the Islamic uh, religion, forgive me, I'm, it's not something I've ever really looked into, uh, but anyways, uh, the Islamic community, some guy found this after years, like four years of this game being out, I, I don't know what he was doing, how do you sit here for ages and then decide, hey, let me just Take a look at this. Oh, gosh. Um, but yeah, it was that painting that uh, had some, like, it was like Praise Allah or something along those lines. Anyways, uh, the Islamic community tweeted Infinity Ward saying that they want the map removed, otherwise they're boycotting all future Infinity Ward products. Um, and so, oh, and their reasoning for this isn't because of what it said, necessarily. But because of where it is, um, in the Islamic community, or religion, I should say, not community, but you're not allowed to um, have paintings on in disgusting areas. No, no, not paintings, go. You're not allowed to have any kind of religious uh, worship or any of that kind of stuff in a place of disgrace, e.g. a bathroom here. Let me just give you a nice... Mm, yum. Um... If I was playing Duke Nukem, I should reach in and grab that. Anyways, um, yeah, so they finally decided to, uh, they patched it, because, and I love this map, right? This is like one of my favorite maps, so I'm glad they brought it back. And now you can see they've changed all the borders um, around the map. They're all like this now. They're just plain black, nothing fancy. They used to be like this gold, awesome-looking trim. Um, but, wait. Is that a painting, 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 painting? Never mind. I'm just crazy. Um, but yeah, that's I, I have no proof um, because unfortunately I haven't been able to find a game. Uh, no, I well, okay, I haven't recorded any games on Favela, and even if I did, there would be no way of me actually proving that it's from today. It was actually patched on the... Uh, 7th or 6th, depending on where you are in the world, um, of December. And today is the 8th. So, it's, yeah, it's been released for a day. And, yeah, this is a really long ramble about something that should have taken two seconds. To sum up, they brought back Favela to the online matchmaking. I can't prove it because, well, I just don't think there's a way. I have played on Favela online again, though. Um, and I am, I'm... You know, I'm telling the truth. They they wouldn't just decide to change all the borders and not put it back in the map, uh, in the map, you know, rotation. Anyways, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Uh, I apologize because the mic quality is probably terrible because I have had to switch mics for the night. But I wanted to get this out, so um, I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.